Hello guys, so in today's vlog, we are going to my tita's wedding reception. She's the same tita pala who made Sama Me doon sa pop-up store ng BTS sa SM Mega Mall noong June. I posted a vlog if you want to watch that. It's in the information card on the top right corner of your screen. So today, we're gonna attend that wedding reception. And after that, I'm going to Chinoma to buy my new MacBook Air M1. And in the same video, in the same vlog, I will also be discussing how to get the student educational discount so where you can save up to 8,000 pesos when buying a new MacBook. Wow. So if you want to see that, don't skip and watch until the end of the video. So for now, I'll just prepare some breakfast, um, drink some coffee since um, I feel kind of tired, no? And probably just shower and leave right away because I woke up kind of late. So I'm actually here now. Medyo na late pa ako. Here na, I'm gonna host the event. Actually, co-host. Finally got the MacBook. And dito na siya. Ayan. Of course, ito si Miss Tin. Yung nag help sa amin. Thank you, Miss Tin. So, this is probably the most awaited part of my vlog. And in this part of my vlog, I'll talk about how I got this MacBook Air from Power Mac Center for 8,000 pesos less on a student discount. I'll get started with the obvious first. In order for you to avail the discount, you need to be a student. Kaya nga ang tawag sa kanya. Student discount. Kasi, pang student yung discount, diba? Okay, so speaking of being a student, meron bang requirements or grade level requirements para ma-avail tong discount na to? And the answer to that question is no. So regardless if you're a K-12 student like me since I'm grade 11, or if you're a university student, you can also avail the student discount. It doesn't matter which school you're coming from, as long as you are a student studying in a school, you are eligible for a discount. Although for more information on this, I suggest you contact PowerMac. So now let's talk about the requirements I needed to pass sa PowerMac para ma laman ko kung maa-avail ko ba ang student discount. So obviously, the first thing I passed is my proof of enrollment. Ang pinaka-valid na proof of enrollment na tinatanggap ng PowerMac Center is yung school ID ninyo. Although in my case, ginamit ko yung official receipt ng bayad ko sa tuition fee and tinanggap yon ng PowerMac so you can use that as well. Hingin nyo lang sa parents ninyo or if you have a copy of that, then you can use that. Now, let's talk about where I got the student discount. So according to PowerMac, as far as Manila is concerned, Lahat ng mga major branches nila sa Manila, dun mo, dun mo lang pwede avail yung student discount. So that's Trinoma, Greenbelt 3, Mega Mall, and North Edsa respectively. Pagkakaalam ko, this is also available sa province. But I suggest or advise you to call your PowerMac Center branch in advance para malaman mo kung saan pwede i-avail yung student discount. So what I did is to call my preferred Ma Power Mac Center branch in my case, Chinoma sa so ang ginawa ko. Hello, is this Power Mac Chinoma? I want to avail you to the discount. So pag sinabi mo dun sa staff ng Power Mac sa branch na yun, sasabihin nila sa'yo yung requirements na kailangan mo when it comes to availing the student discount. They're gonna ask you to send that through their official Viper account. Dun din mangyayari yung approval process ng student discount. So dun mo kailangan isend yung required documents such as yung proof of enrollment sa Viber account ng PowerMac branch na pag gusto mong pagbilhan. Ang sa akin kasi, since mabilito MacBook Air na 
na kinuha ko is pinareserve ko na siya two days before. So, ayun, pagpunta ko sa store, ready na yung laptop, hindi ko na siya pina-unbox doon. Dito ko na sa bahay pina-unbox. So, yes. Yun yung nangyari. So, yun lang ginawa ko, guys. And, ayun, nakatipid ako ng 8,000 pesos when I bought this MacBook Air.